why is the Heavenly Father, which we're going to continue to read on, using that example as a as sin, if it's a righteous thing to look like that. Go ahead, bro. It says, uh, verse 11, and Aaron said, and Aaron said unto Moses, at last, my Lord, I beseech thee, lay not the sin upon us. See? You see what that just said? Lay not this sin upon us. So to look like that is a sin. So to look like that is a sin. Go ahead, bro. Wherein we have done foolishly, and wherein we have sinned. See? Go ahead. So when they seen their sister marry them, and she was hit with leprosy, right? As white as snow, they knew that she had sinned, man. Right? Transgressed the law. So this Edomite has put himself up as the anointed of the Bible to look so-called white. And to look like that is sin. Craziness, man. Uh -huh. Go ahead, bro. So verse 12. Let her not be as one dead. Let her not be as one dead. So to have that pigment, they were looking at her as if she was lifeless. She had been stripped of her pigment, and they were looking at her as if she was lifeless, man. She was out of there, man. And guess what? These people uphold the way these so-called white people look in pride and in ignorance. As if it's a great thing to look like them. But you people going to soon find out. While you wrapped up in your pride to look like that is not good at all in the eyes of the heavenly father and his son. And the Israelites who do look like that and are of the elect, they're going to get changed back to their rightful pigment. Okay? Which is different shades of brown. Okay? And you're going to know in the kingdom who Esau is and you're going to look at him in this pigment and say that's the man of sin right there that's the devil but right now since your eyes been darkened and the God of this world has blinded you you look at us like we nutcases right right <laughs> We read straight out the scriptures, which you claim you believe in. Right. Yeah. Go ahead, bro. It says, uh, of whom the flesh is half consumed. Of whom the flesh is half consumed, man. So what did she originally look like? She was dark skinned. Uh -huh. Now she look, since she been her flesh been consumed, now she look as if one was dead, lifeless. Uh -huh. And they said. According to the scriptures in number 12, she was white as snow. Okay. And they said, lay not this sin upon us. Okay. Go ahead, bro. It says, uh, of whom the flesh is half consumed when he cometh out of his mother's womb. Sure. <laughs> See that? And that's all I wanted out of that. But, hey, man. This place, man. Give me Exodus uh, 4 and 6. Exodus 4 and 6. All right. This is uh, Exodus chapter 4, verse 6. And Yahweh by some Yahushua said, Furthermore unto him, But now thy hand, put now thy hand into thy bosom. Be talking to Moses. Okay? That's what we're talking to in Exodus the 6th chapter. 
He talking to Moses. Go ahead. And he put his hand into his bosom. And when he took it out, behold, his hands was leprous as snow. See that? Leprous as snow. In other words, white, so to speak. Go ahead. And he said, put thine hand into thy bosom again. And he put his hand into his bosom again and plucked it out of his bosom. And behold, it was turned again as his other flesh. What was his other flesh? He was dark skinned. Right. right. See? So Moses, which is a Levite, was dark skinned. Mm. Okay? There you go. So give me Jeremiah 14 and 2. This is uh, Jeremiah chapter 14, verse 2. Judah mourneth. That's the Jews, right? Because Judah is short. Jew, Jew is short for Judah. Okay? So there go the Jew right there. Go ahead. And the gates thereof language. The gates are the leaders. Go ahead. They are black unto the ground. Uh-oh. They are dark skinned and in a low state. See? Go ahead. And the cry of Jerusalem is gone up. Yeah. So it's telling you right there, man. It's telling you right there. So give me Songs of Solomon. And Solomon, no, I mean, uh, yeah, Songs of Solomon, not wisdom. Oh, 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 it's like Songs of Solomon. So it's telling you right there that the Jew is so called black. Okay? Songs of Solomon, it might be around there. Look not upon me because I am black. It might be around the uh, fourth. Or the, no, it might be about the sixth verse. See what we got there. So first chapter. First chapter, verse six. Look not upon me because I am black. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. This is a song of Solomon, chapter one, verse five. It says, uh, "I am black, but comely, beautiful." Go ahead. O oh, ye daughters of Jerusalem, as the tents of Kedar, Kedar, as the curtains, the curtains, uh, so like it, as the curtains of Solomon. All right. Now, what I want you to do, bro, is say, I'm thinking about Job. Look not upon me because I am black. I'm thinking oh. about. Oh, I said that there. Go on, go on. You, oh. you have call it. Yeah, go on. Oh, I'm still like it, bro. My mind is spinning. Because I'm thinking about Job, too. Come on, come on. But what I want you to do is uh, Google image the tents of Kadar. And let's see what the tents of Kadar look like. Okay? Because he mentioned the tents of Kadar. So the tents of Kadar must be dark. Stop laughing at him, bro. Don't laugh at him, bro. Stop laughing at him. Don't laugh at him, bro. You're wrong. <laughs> Don't laugh at him now. Man. Don't laugh at him, bro. Why are you laughing at him? Show them the tents of Kadar. Stop it, man. Stop it. Why are you showing sure that? I got to do it, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man. So now you see the tents of Kadar, right? Let me see, bro. My goodness. So read that again. This Did is they up. actually see it to where it said it's the tents of Kadar? Did they actually see it at the bottom? Uh see if you can pull it up. All right. Make sure you hit it, hit it. And see if they say the tents of Kadar at the bottom. Yeah, it is. Yeah, show it, show it, show it. Make sure they see it because you know they'll say, oh, no, that's Photoshop. You made it up. Come on, come on, come on. 
You know what I'm saying? Come. Yeah. Yeah, so read that again. This is uh, the Song of Solomon. It says, chapter 1, verse 5. I am black, but calmly beautiful. So that's Solomon right there. Go ahead. Are ye daughters of Jerusalem, 